Welcome to another tutorial on HitConnect by HitVision. Uh, this is in July 2017 uh, using the latest firmware and app. So the first thing to do is install the app which is called HitConnect. Uh, this will vary slightly depending on what phone you have. So I'm not going to go into great details on this. Uh, just make sure it's by HitVision and not by any other party just in case there's any malicious software on it. So start the app if it's not started already. Uh, click on Hit Connect at the very bottom of the screen. Click on Register. Agree to the terms and then click Register by mobile phone number. Input your country and click Finish. Input your mobile phone number without the country code because the country code is already selected at the top and then click get verification code. You'll be sent an SMS which normally arrives within a few seconds and enter that on the next screen where it says verification code and click next. Now select a username or enter a username and a password. Password needs to be at least eight digits long containing at least an uppercase and a lowercase and ideally a number. This can be the same as your recorder if you wish but not necessarily. When you're done click finish. Next stage is to add your device. So just click on the plus sign at the top. Click on scan QR code. That means quick read code. Uh, your phone will open up to the camera. So you need to scan what's called the QR code on the DVR. So if you go to network platform access and scan the QR code. Note that the status of the recorder says online. If it says anything else, it's not gonna work. So go back and recheck your recorder settings. If for some reason the QR code isn't accepted, you can then put nine digit serial number. This is available on the maintenance screen. It's just numbers only, or nine numbers together. So this is what your camera will look like, and you scan it, the serial number appears on the screen, click add to continue, and you'll be presented with the, the next screen, so click on the tick at the top. Now this screen shows all the cameras uh, blank, so just click on any square to add a camera. And here you have all your cameras. If you have any problems connecting to the DVR, refer to the other video on initial power up. 